With a text as boring and repetitive as the Book of Mormon, it can be hard to follow along with the so-called plot without getting jealous of those people who end up in a coma for 40 years. So for those of you who find following along with the meandering and largely plagiarized path of the last few chapters difficult, we'd like to present part three of Mormon Peace Theater. Last time on Mormon Peace Theater. I'm Nephi, and I'm the best totally great dude. And, and we're, we're his, his brothers. brothers. Brothers, let us go to America in this boat I built of curious workmanship. No, I'd, I'd, I'd rather kill you. Mm, yeah, that sounds good. Ser seriously? Again? This is like, this is like the eighth time. Uh, eighth time's the charm. Seriously, guys, cut it out. Right, the god guy. Totally forgot about him. How about who? I don't remember. Let's kill Nephi. And now, on with the show. Hey, Dad. Uh, what you doing? Just getting ready to make a big, boring speech and then die. Oh, yeah? You are going to do that? Yeah. That sounds, well, that sounds super boring. Yep. Okay. But uh, what if in a couple thousand years there's like a podcast? A what? Steel Swords. Fair. Right. So if this podcast wanted to make your super boring speech interesting, uh, what would you say they should do? Hmm. I suppose they could try retelling parts of it as their favorite characters. Oh, no, no. Hi, I'm Pony D from Big Boring Speeches. Is your speech big and boring? Let us spice it up with a wacky band of characters. Hi, I'm Inside Out Little Girl, and sweet Jesus on a cracker, who the hell even remembers what show I'm from? But I'd love to help. You would? I can taste my own liver. Go for it. Boy, oh boy, if my butthole wasn't so close to my mouth, I'd be smiling. And I just want to say that no one will ever come to this land unless God intends it. You see, I was right all along. Secretary of Housing and Urban Development, Ben Carson. Where? No, 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 that's you. Is it? Well, this is perfect, because this is the bullshit history section. Take it away, Ben. Okay, thanks, Inside Out, little girl. Gonna take away your health care. You sure are. Okay, so back in 590 B.C. when Nephi and his family arrived, nobody lived here except for animals like horses, which were totally here, peacocks, and VW bugs. Lehi realized this would be a good land, and many would flourish as long as they would stop trying to kill their brother. Oh, pretty please, Lehi said. Stop trying to kill your brother, and everyone will live heavily after ever. With all the animals that are totally in America at this time, like elephants and pug dogs. Did somebody say pug dogs? <laughs> Call the pug a pegacon. What are you doing here? Oh, I just thought I'd stop by to tell everyone about my favorite chapters of 2 Nephi. Chapters 2 and 3. Well then, let's see it. First off, let me just say, Jacob, my other son, He's a great kid. But you know who's really awesome? Who now? People named Joseph. Oh, boy, does God love people named Joseph. What a great name. A guy with a name like that, he's got some moxie. That guy is awesome, like Moses. Now, even I know Moses doesn't exist yet. <laughs> oh, shit, you're right. Well, there's going to be a guy named Moses. He'll be like him. Seems like a weird comparison. It'll be in the Bible. Hasn't been written yet. Well, it will be. This is ridiculous. Okay. Anyway, one day there will be a guy like that guy from the book that hasn't been written yet, but even more awesome. Seems like a stretch. I'm a flying dog with a horn. You sure are. Well, that made no sense. Well, that's why I'm here. Ray Comfort. Ray Comfort. <laughs> That's right, it's me, Ray Comfort. When I hear a holy book isn't making sense, I come along as fast as a drop bear to a ripened pear. Well, you're just in time to talk about the rest of 2 Nephi chapter 3. I sure am. And I've got to say, there's some rock-hard evidence here that God exists. For instance, if God isn't real, why does everything have an opposite? Like peanuts and ten yellow hornets. 
Wait, what are the opposite of those things? Don't interrupt. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, which reminds me, anyone who doesn't believe in this book is an asshole. A total asshole. Now, doesn't that sound like God to you? It sure does. Something like that. Yeah, I feel like that would be one guy talking to himself for like eight minutes. Hmm. Yeah, do a fucking voice then. Ooh, meta. And so it came to pass that Lehi finally died. Ooh, one more thing. Nope, no, no. And so it was that Lehi finally died. And I was very, very sad. <laughs> hey. Hey, buddy, what's the matter? I'm just, I'm just sad about, about dad dying. Aw, oh, you know, us too. I mean, less so probably because he kept telling us we were evil. But still, you know, we're sad. Too. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah. Yeah. Would you feel better if we plotted to kill you again? Oh, you, you guys would do that? For, for me? We sure would. Hey, Nephi. <laughs> yeah? Murmur, murmur, murmur. Murmur, murmur, murmur. Murmur, murmur. <laughs> you guys are the best. Nephi. Nephi. What? What? I'm, I'm sleeping. I was sleeping. Oh, oh, I, I came to tell you your brothers are going to try to kill you again. Uh, it's a Tuesday already? Yeah, uh, so here's the thing. I was thinking maybe you should just leave. Uh, leave? Aren't you just going to send another angel to stop them? Or uh, I, Well, yeah, about that. I got to tell you, buddy, the travel costs are starting to kill me on this. The, the costs? Yeah, I mean, I, I either got to send an angel or come down myself every 10 minutes. And, and don't get me wrong, I appreciate the miles and everything, but there's only so much I can write off, you know? Oh, okay. I guess so. Cool. All right. Do, do you validate parking? None of those words. And so I took my family to a new and safer part of the new world. Ah, here we are. Nephi. What? I shall call this city Nephi. You're naming this city Nephi? Uh, no? No, it's fine. You don't like it. it I didn't say that. No. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't not say it either. It don't sounds do like you this. Don't. Uh, all right. Ne Nephivania? Uh, Neefland? Nephistan? Nephi is fine. J just fine? Not great? Sometimes I really get your brothers. What? Nothing. And so it came to pass that we did flourish in the land. We flourished greatly. So greatly. Like, really... Really greatly. In fact, I'm so insistent about this that you kind of feel like we didn't flourish, except I'm pretty obviously fictional. Ah, my son Thomas. Hey, Dad, what are you making? Uh, steel swords. Really? All the way, uh, now, huh? Yeah, yeah, well, well I had Laban's sword, so, you know, it's pretty easy, really. To, to copy uh, a steel sword because because you have one. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. You're being kind of negative, son. I mean, be careful. I will cut off your feet and nobody in your family will ever have feet. I have feet. <laughs> Got him. I hate you guys. No, absolutely not. Noah, come on. What's up? Hey, hey, folks, Noah here. So this is the part of the book where God curses the Lamanites with black skin and Eli wrote this section before I got a chance to read it. Uh, don't, so, don't spoil it. Come on. Yeah, yeah. No, I'm sure it's 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 fine. I now mean, look, what's the problem? Oh, no, no. Yeah. None of this. So <laughs> suffice not. it to say, we will not be acting out this part of the Book of Mormon, okay? The Lamanite skin turned black and they turned lazy and evil. That's what it says in the Book of Mormon, and that's plenty. Oh, just, oh. You really, uh, really went all out with the... Makeup, huh? Oh, well, I don't never see no, 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 no. no. Uh -huh. no. See, and they would have, they would have, you would have loved it. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jacob, and now Isaiah. 
You're welcome. You're welcome. Just save you four fucking chapters. Blah, blah, blah. Isaiah, heaven is nice. Hell is not. Blah, 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 blah. See you next time. This has been Mormon Peace <laughs> Theater. <laughs> it's my favorite.